I'm a grandmother. An army travels on its petroleum reserves, something you liberals tend to forget. Your beloved commander-in-chief, incurious George, tries one more time to kill Social Security. Senior officials confirm off the record that the Shrub administration appears to be moving closer to an invasion of oil richest dam. I'm going to serve. It's not dinner time. In the military. <laughs> what? I'll find him if I have to seduce every general and admiral in Washington to see. <laughs> what contest? Why Social Security should be privatized now. The winner will appear with the president on national TV and deliver the prize-winning essay to the nation. You play a psychopathic killer. You can play a conservative. <laughs> <laughs> no one gets near the president. No one. You read me, Jones? No one gets near the president, sir. Uh, cranks. Al Qaeda. The ACLU. <laughs> George, read my lips. No improvising. <laughs> They'll know who rules. Carl, cringing, clump, pimply Carl. <laughs> they see me, me. Dorothy, darling. But we have a CD. It's right here. It's right here in my hand. <gasps> oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Mr. President, your reforms have made us a stronger America. And I, on behalf of all seniors, salute you. This war is destroying our safety and our credulability as a tolerant people. <laughs> it is not being fought for our safety. This war is being fought for a lot. <laughs> I am your grandmother. <laughs> <laughs> If you call me Dorothy, 